Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel, thanks for watching this time with another Pils from Bavaria. It's from the Pyras or Landbier Brauerei located in Pyras in Talmessing uh, in uh, Mittel Franken. Um, and uh, yeah, this is their Pils. I've had one beer from, the, from this brew before on the channel. It was their Helles Landbier. Now it's time for a Pils. Refreshing, fantastic uh, Pils. So high expectations of this one because their Helles Landbier was great and uh, the brewery is giving a real nice impression to me regarding um, their website and everything like that, which I will of course link to in the description box below as always. Um, so typical for um, how Pils bottles used to look like, they have the much green on the label, that's how often you um, uh, design the, the labels for the Pils style, um, since the hops is, uh, is green uh, in their color and uh, Pils is the, the beer style with a much strong hops taste, so that makes sense. Uh, I'm gonna give you some short information, up to the information about the, the history of this brewery, uh, which I will hope that you want to listen to. Um, the Pyrasur Land Brewery is a brewery in the Talmessing district of Pyras. Since 2000, a large range of non-alcoholic drinks has been rounding off the range by drilling a mineral water well as Pyrasur Forest Spring. In 2017, 190,000 hectares of beverages were produced, of which 40% was beer. In 1749, Johann Adam Barn Bernreuter bought the Zum Angerwirt Manor. In 1865, the forest plots in Franconia, including those of Adam, Adam uh, Bernreuter, were badly damaged by the uh, noon butterflies. The damaged wood had to be felled and the price dropped due to the high supply. The Angerwirt's beer supplier also did not buy the wood. Adam Bernreuter is said to have been so upset that he founded his own brewery in 1870. The Bernreuter family had already had a brewery. Uh, in 1649, Hans Bernreuter took over a brewery in Offenbau. Since September 2015, the brewery has been a member of the Die Freie Brauer Initiative, an association of medium-sized private breweries, mainly from Germany and Austria. Uh, that's some information about this brewery. And uh, I have really high expectations of this pills, but it's going to be really fantastic and refreshing in, in taste. Uh, that's much to say about that, so I'm gonna give you some information about this uh, this specific beer, the Pils, which I've been taking from their website, uh, which I will, as I said, of course, link to. Uh, Weit Ulrich, the landlord of Pilas, laid the foundation stone for the Bernreuter family's brewing passion in 1647 with the acquisition of the brewery and restaurant Zum Schwarzen Bern in neighboring Eilsölden. Um, Pilsner Brauart has always meant the use of particularly gently dried barley, which produces a very light malt. It requires slow, cold fermentation and long storage, for which cold caves and deep cellars were used in ancient times. Since the Pilsner is more hoppy, the quality of the green umbels is of crucial importance. For the Pyraso Pils, specially grown aroma hops are used by the contract farmer from the Roth district. The sapphire variety used brings the typical aroma of fresh hop field shortly before the fall into the finished beer. This creates a unique Franconian pils, which is by no means bitter, but hop aromatic, flowery. White Ulrich, the manager, declared this fine bitter beer to be his favorite drink, a Franconian pils now. Uh, that sparkles brilliantly, straw yellow in the glass, and ends in a firm foam soft crown. It tastes great with food, but more and more people appreciate it as a fresh sip, like an aperitif. And that's what I'm going to, to uh, drink it like right now, of course. Um, you see, uh, if we're gonna review the bottle to start with, here's the cap of Pyraso Pils, and you see that they're name and their logo is printed here on the bottle, which I always appreciate. It shows that they care extra much about how their bottle is looking, um, that they uh, order their own bottles um, made specifically for uh, for the brewery. So quite big brewery. Um, 
located in, in the middle of Franken region in Bavaria. So I said, Gebraut mit Aroma Hopfen, and that is very high quality. Gebraut mit Mineralwasser, so uh, perfectly uh, quality on, on the raw materials of this one. Um, bitte verschlossen zurück, nichts einfüllen. Okay. Pyrasso Pils, gebraut mit Aromahopfen, ein kleines Dorf im Frankenland, ist durch sein gutes Bier bekannt, nur mit Aromahopfen gebraut. Lieblingsbier von Braumeister, Originalrezeptur Helmut Sauerhammer. Uh, that's very promising, uh, actually. I know after all my reviews that this is very, very promising, uh, these words. Nur Aromahopfen, that's gonna be tasting fantastic. To be honest, it's a big different regarding the freshness, the strongness of the, the hops taste while you use only fresh aroma hopfen um, and the original recipe also, of course, here's the back label um, Gebraut mit aroma hopfen Ein fränkisches Pils, das gelesen Strogelb in Glas perlt und einer festen schaumzarten Krone endet Es reift mit viel Geduld Seinen Hopfen aromatischen Geschmack bekommt es vom eigens für Pyrasser angebauten Aromahopfen. Zutaten Brauwasser, Gerstermalt, Hopfen, no Hopfen extract, which is great. Uh, Hopfen, Perle, Select und Saphir, that's three very high quality hops um, types used in this one. Uh, Pyrasser Landbrauerei, located in Talmessing. Uh, Pyrrhasur Landbrauerei GmbH and Company KG. Uh, so, that's it regarding the bottle. Uh, over to the tasting part, my favorite part of course. Really, really, really look forward to this pills. Super high expectations of it, but it's gonna be... Uh, to be honest, it's possible that it's gonna be one of my favorite tasting pills that I've had on the channel. So, uh, much is... Um, as uh, leaning towards that it's gonna be a, a super super high um, appreciated pills by me uh, and I love pills extremely much one well, let's look at the label and their logo of the brewery Pirasso Pils only brewed with aroma hopfen I don't need this one since Pirasso is using a, a screw um, cap like this There we go. And let's pour it up. This one is gonna be so fantastic. Super, super high expectations of it. You see how fresh it looks. Fantastic with a foam head. Look at that. What a compact white foam head. Always, always shows high quality with a big foam head like this. And uh, to be honest, I bet it's gonna be absolutely stunning in taste. Um, compact, compact white crown and perfect straw yellow color, bright, bright yellow, uh, making this to be a very, very strong hops taste. Look at this, how beautiful it is looking. Really, really beautiful. Let's get the aroma. Yeah, no doubt about it. It's a high quality pills. The hops. Freshly hops. Um, aroma is there, of course. Very, very promising. Um, I love it so much. The, the grassy. Hops, dry bitterness, you know what I'm talking about if you've had one of these high quality German Pilsners. Look at that. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. So, the Pirasso Pils. Let's taste it. Prost! Absolutely amazing. To be honest, it's um, 
it's really obvious how much difference it's um, it's making to the to the final product, the final beer. Uh, while only 100% carefully selected aroma hopfen is being used, no hopfen extract, nothing like that. Only fresh green uh, hops of absolutely highest quality. The three hops types used for this one is Perle, Select and Saphir and that's three really 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 great ones. I know that from um, from what I've been reading this is a fantastic pills of course. Tastes really really grassy, um, dry, strong in, in the hops uh, flavor. That's always what you return to while reviewing a pills. The, uh, the hops taste, that's what what you want from a pills. So refreshing and nice this one. Really, really high quality. Always right time for a pills and I understand why this is the favorite beer from the brewmaster himself. This is fantastic pills. Of course, pills is um, a very, very pop popular uh, beer style all over the world and of course uh, also in Germany um, it's the most popular beer style if I'm not wrong um, mostly in northern Germany northern Germany loves their pills so much it's the without a doubt the main beer uh, style in northern Germany um, northern Germany that's where you where you're getting the pills um, of course as in this case, Pils is loved even uh, in uh, Bavaria. They do, to be honest, an amazing Pils with this one. It's really, really fresh and nice. So it's a big recommendation. If you are a Pils lover, you're going to love this one really, really much. 100% fresh grown aroma hopfen and fresh mineral water uh, to brew it with take it from their own uh, deep well of course they're having the, the forest uh, this brewery where they grow the raw materials so absolutely an amazing brew this one an amazing pills um, so it's a big recommendation and a great great brewery Pirasso I also have other beers from this brewery which I'm gonna try in the future but um, to be honest this one is the one that I've been uh, looking forward to the most because um, it's probably my favorite beer style as simple as that Pils is so so nice I'm used to Pils very much and uh, just like many others I prefer Pils I would say since it's uh, this great great hops um, hops taste in it, that's so fantastic. It's just how beer should taste. It should be like a pills, like this one. So, I think that is for now. As I used to say, hope you like my reviews. That you continue to follow the channel, uh, support it, uh, like, comment, subscribe, and hope I see you again in the uh, next German Bear View.